Greetings everyone and welcome back to the final station. Ooh, you're covered in blood. That's not that's not good, mate. Finally. Is the cargo safe? I know, but we have no time. David and I are the only survivors. What? Of this whole town? David went to the city. He has the blockers code. Why do you keep leaving? You need to find them. And I'm going to release the cargo. By the way, there's a storefront with weapons upstairs in my front, in my office, in my front. What? Good luck. I, I, I was <laughs> when I said storefront with weapons, weapons uh, upstairs in my office. I was checking the word storefront as I was reading the rest of it, which is why I said uh, in my front instead of in my office. Don't go to the subway. Okay. I actually that sounds a fairly good advice the subway is always the worst place to go when there are zombies or even not to zombies there oh my lord press tab or right bumper and it'll be tab for me i've got a shotgun pistol ammo shotgun ammo pistol ammo okay i got a lot of pistol ammo is this loaded but only two shotgun ammo. i'm gonna assume that this is really good at taking things down uh, so i'm gonna save it or at least try to fast one is no nope. okay um. Hmm. Hello. Hello. Pills, cons. I need to make more med kits. Actually. Oh. What are these things that I see everywhere? They're like little capsules. Is it possible those are bombs? Hmm. Yeah, they might be, given the shape. They, I mean, they've not I wonder what that is. No, they'd be odd kinds of bombs. Still. Literally, have I got to go to... Of course I've got to go to... Oh my good lord. <laughs> no! Let me through. Let, let, can I... Can I not... Can I jump? No, I cannot. Okay, well... Uh, I've got two... Two shells, though, for the shotgun. This this can't possibly... Be, this little ones... Uh, Right, okay, going that way is not possible. Going that way, maybe. Um, depending on what we find. I mean, I'm going to assume that it's, it, this is meant to be some sort of gauntlet. I'm going to use the shotgun. I'm going to drop down. I'm going to run past you because I can usually run past one, at least. I'll shotgun you and we'll see how it goes. Two. Oh, no, 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 no. Really? You can't keep up with me if I'm running away? Oh my lord, that is the best news. Let's load this up then. I could shotgun you, but frankly, I have no particular reason to want to. Okay. Well, that was quite interesting. Oh, okay. Hmm, goes down deeper. That is going to be something bad. Oh, I need a battery, do I? Nope. Ah, okay. Battery. Nope. Nope. Whatever you are. Oh, you've got a timer. Okay, well that makes sense. I guess you are literally explosive then. And that when I hit you... I, 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 I knew somehow when I saw that bloody door, I was like, yeah, you're going to put something behind you. Oh, damn it. Problem with the if you're wondering why I sometimes fight the wrong way is that like I'll <laughs> my instinct is to move my mouse to keep it relative to the background. So when like I've got my mouse back here and, and someone's fighting or whatever, I'll click it and I'll start moving back, but uh I'm a derp, basically. Not relative to the background, relative to me. So I'm moving my hand with me as I'm moving back, even though my mouse has nothing to do with it. And then if I move back f far enough, I'm moving the mouse faster than I'm moving me. It's very silly. Either way, I'm just an idiot, basically. There's no justifying it. I'm trying to explain it to you so that maybe you'll think me less of an idiot. But no, I am just an idiot. Wow, they really couldn't hit me while I was moving back. Seems that their lunge attack really is useless. I approve. Workwear and wires. Hello? Pistol ammo? It's T12. I raised the elevator before I left. There will uh, there will be off-schedule dumping from the north main track in the morning. I'm sick of cleaning the elevator every single time. Ah, oh, right, so the track dumps down. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, let's reload our pistol. 
Hello, no. Hello, no. Staff only. Hello. Huh. Do I need to go that way? I might not have to. If I, oh dear. If I don't have to, I don't really want to. That was a bit of a waste of ammo, I'll be honest. $24 worth of money. Hello, empty. Oh, I can't get through. Yes, I have to go. There's another one. Yeah, these are definitely bombs. Oh. Oh, wait, no, no, no. This is like a, a window pane. This is like a mall, I'm guessing, then. I was about to say, are we under a dome? No, it doesn't seem so. But whatever that was, it came through the wall, the, the glass wall, and smashed into the ground. So, yeah, it's some sort of weapon, I would say. But not a bomb, because they're not exploding, obviously. Um, you know what? Let's just get rid of you. Reload. Hmm. That's going to be annoying. It's going to be very annoying to deal with. Um, I've only got nine rounds of my pistol, too, which is terrible news. However, there's one saving grace here. That is that... Oh, pow! No, I can't punch off a step. That is annoying as sin. So I need you to walk away. That's good enough. There we are. Can I shoot in the head? No, I can't. Oh, can't shoot down. I probably just clipped that. But let's try and get the other one first, regardless. There we are. And now I just need to wait for you to wander. No, I, I actually can't shoot down any. Oh, I can. I just can't shoot down any kind of obstacle whatsoever, whether it, it realistically I should be able to shoot around it, like through the banisters or what. Did this make a similar sound in the last place that I walked past? I think it did, actually. There was a hissing sound. And i that's right, I thought it was a heating vent. Are these biological weapons? Also, is anyone else noticing that? Was there ever, like, a, a lighting glint of the others? Or are those two white eyes staring out of this thing? Is it venting some sort of biological agent? Is that why everyone... When it starts like leaking black stuff and then eventually turns into one of these things, because I'm assuming they do. I'm assuming that all the people in that lab had turned into one of these things. Wires, screws. I need to do some more crafting at some point. It's going to be imperative. Uh, we can't get out there, but this place got thoroughly bombed. Oh dear lord! There's two fast ones. There's going to be one in the toilets, isn't it? Yes. No. Yeah. No. Yes. Hello. No. Absolutely not. Pistol ammo, shotgun ammo, gunpowder. All right. Uh, okay, well, that one, no. That one, no. And damn. And I'll just try and punch the both of you. Damn it. That was a waste of ammo. If ever I... Uh, ever it happened. However, on the plus side, we didn't lose any health, which is always good. You're coming with me. We've got two fast ones over there. Oh. 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 Can I? I can... Th nope. I can throw them. Yes. Aha! Though I picked up one that was behind me. Ha 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 ha! Fantastic. Though, oh my lord, I was so close to messing up. If I'd been stood here when I tried to throw that box, I would have just picked up the TV. The way I did with the TV in the middle. Oh, that is so annoying. Kind of cool, though. I, d I don't know. I, I, I'm kind of a fan and kind of not a fan of the way that you don't get, like, a, a border or anything on things that you can interact with in the background. That would make it super... Uh, ooh, wow, you've been here for quite some time. It's uh, 5, 10, 37. Hand... Hmm... Dodgy. You were handcuffed in you for 37 days. Hmm. But it would be nice if there was some sort of border around things so I knew if it, I'd interact with it. But at the same time, this kind of makes it feel a little bit more interesting in a way. And I'm just going to punch you until you stop moving. That sounds so much worse than I meant for it to. 
And uh, no, that is still probably in the cafe. Hello? Ooh. Do you move faster than the others? You know what? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. I'm going to stay up here. Oh, you killed the others. That is fantastic. I had hoped you would. Truth be told, I was like, are you a walking bomb? Am I going to be able to use you tactically? Yes. Yes, I am. Ooh. Was that it? Can I play it more? Can I take it with me? Okay, I'm much worse of a, of a drum player than I am of a guitar player. Alright. What about in here? Okay, just one. Pow. What about you? Pistol ammo coins, med kit. What I really need is food, money. One food. Two med kits now. That'll probably be enough. Hello? Hello? Oh. Guardian. A fact or fiction? For what law-abiding citizens' taxes are spent in truth? By Irvin B. Uh, Irvin B. Omega Publishing House. Money? 32. But what's the whole thing with the settlers? That's something I'm desperate to find out about. There's a whole thing going on there. No, 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 and no again. Uh, so all kinds of political issues on top of the whole not zombie thing. Hello? Oh, this one isn't hissing. Hmm, why is that? Why aren't you hissing? Welcome to Vacation Hotel. Peace and comfort. Guests of the Vacation Hotel are provided with three meals and health improving services. Enrichment activities start at 8. Dinner is served at 9. Bring your cutlery. Please do not leave the hotel grounds without altering, uh, alerting a member of staff. Or altering them. Please don't alter the members of staff. That is really rude. Bring your own cutlery, though? Suddenly, the whole spoon thief thing makes a lot more sense. Wow, look at all that machinery in the wall. Hello? I knew something was wrong with this house. No one believed me. Last week, they came for Matthew below. And yesterday, they came for the guy upstairs. I heard them come in. I'm in the I'm the next one, no doubt. Get out while you can then, mate. Welcome to Vacation Hotel. Same thing, cutlery, whiskey. Why not food? Food is all I desire. Food? Report 403. The sample is processed, immobilized, placed into general storage. The room is clean. Change bed sheets. New inspection in three days. Oh. All the black goo there. Was this some sort of experimentation area? In which case, what are these bombs things? I mean, that makes no sense all of a sudden. Because, hmm. I mean, if it's an experimentation that's doing that stuff to people, then it makes no sense that they were attacked to, co oh, damn it, to cause it to happen. Good old exploding not zombies. Nope. Afraid not. Oh, it does actually. It isn't like a number of things. Because I wasn't sure if like each hit did a certain amount of hit points worth of damage and they had a certain total. Or whether it was one strong hit for light hits. But it, it does seem to actually uh, count. Oh, damn it. Didn't have enough room anymore. Shotgun ammo, medkit, food, guardian, keychain. Ooh. Something about the Guardian. Something weird is happening in the house next to me. I heard screams last night. But I don't care about that now. I dreamt of those symbols again. The old man told me about the canyon in the mountains to the west. He thinks they will start from there. If so, I need to be there when they open the passage. I can't get there via the south. I'll take a shortcut through the me through Metropole. X. So who's X? And what is that ca the dream thing? Because I saw symbols in that flash forward slash dream. Oh, my lord, there's a lot of you. Hello? Stay where you are. Are you from the train? Why, yes, I am. Well, I'm sorry. Oh, dear, are you going to kill me? We have two, three. We need to take them. I'm not going. I still have one thing. Wow. I mean, yeah, I can't fit you all on board, so... 
No, I, I have some ammo. Just worry about yourself. Uh, okay then, buddy. Well, you're not wounded, so... A train? Okay, I'm, I'm waiting for you there. Um, don't be ridiculous. I did not get out. Take the others. Hmm. You're going to stay here with your friend. Valiant last stand, I understand. Thank God. Okay, I'll try. Well, best of luck, gents. Ah, oh, thank goodness. More medkit, more food. Three food, four medkits. This is good. Upper House of Metropole. To David Rowland, head of New Costfield Station. Confirmation of block is code 3398. And a key. We have a key! Finally, we are gone. Is there something going to be over there? Would it be worth me trying to find out? You know what? No, it wouldn't. I choose life. There could be awesome things down there. I mean, I've got a key, but that let me out through that gate. It's fine. I'm not even going to think about the awesome mega treasures that I could have found there if I went that way. No, because I'm alive. And being alive means that I can take care of other things. Oh, was I meant to talk to you? Man, you are a mess, but best of luck. Couldn't you have come with us? Damn. All right. <sighs> right, let's have a look at you then. Uh, you're okay, but you're bleeding. Can I have some food? Uh, yes, you can. Ooh, shipping. I need help. We're in the shopping center when it all started. I want to escape through the parking lot. Don't worry, I'm coming. But they were already there. Not sparking. This is. Now we're safe. Bristol is a stone's throw away. Oh. Oh. Oh dear. What? What a... There's... Was there a town in those hills just now? Oh, God. Was there, like, a, a city... Oh, my lord. But there were people. I think so. So this is what was in that cup. Oh, wow. Do you think that was us? Wait. We... Was that where we just came from? Because, I, I mean, I've honestly not got much of an idea in terms of the directions and everything. Thank God. Wow. Is it Bristol? Yes. What is this? It's the main plant. Nebel hers. Uh, I need help. Okay, okay, okay. I've got you. I've got you some help. You're going to need help in a little bit. Let's get that charged properly. Dunk. Okay, loads of houses. Ooh. Weird looking cyber eye. Oh, so this is what those lights were on all the spies. Are you sure? Is everything fine here? Yeah, I don't know. It's got robot eyes on the buildings. That's never a good sign. The main factory works. These creatures could scarcely launch it. Very funny. Mm. It's always like this down here. I need help. Coming. There you go. The cars. Does anyone have food? I'm telling you, everything's fine. Need a doctor? No, you don't. Ha! We're here. Hopefully, this is where you're going to get off. Otherwise, I'm going to have to give you loads of supplies. We shall see. Yes. Okay. Rhonda Miles, unemployed, hundred dollars. John Cocker, shop assistant, sixty dollars, and twelve pistol ammo. It looks like. Bob Nelson, retiree. $70 and six pills? Martin Jarvis, writer, librarian. $140 he paid. Wow, that's awesome. Scott Denman, freelancer. $70, two pistol rounds. Amanda Wingrab, waitress. $210. Wow. Well done. Passion Survive 6, profit 650. And, you know. Apparently delivering a nuke some of that. That is a horrible... <laughs> My lord. Thanks again. Sorry, I need to discuss a few things. Oh, fair enough. It seems nobody here is aware of what's going on. Oh. Can you easily miss a nuke going off? He'll be fine. 
So you're saying you were bitten by someone? Yeah, they don't seem to quite understand. Well, I mean, that's a good thing. It hasn't reached you yet. I know. You've already figured out where it goes. Take your family and save yourself, man. Oh, yeah. You have an order. What? Uh, hmm. No. I'm not sure what you were talking about there. No? Nothing to say? Well, fine. I didn't want to talk to you anyway. I've stopped the bleeding. An ambulance will come soon, and we'll take him to the hospital. Your bandage skills are not so good, though. Uh, look, you know, I didn't put those bandages on, to be fair. Well, I guess I may have a few times. Hello? No? I'm just adjusting your helmet. Peace out. Okay. Fair enough. Are you... Uh, going from the north? Is everything okay there? I can't contact them. Uh, no. It's really not. By the way, do you hear this strange noise about an hour ago? Hmm. What? Are you okay? I don't understand what you're talking about. Uh, I, I guess it might be hard to accept, but I mean, we gotta warn them. Sorry, I have some work to do. You won't when those things arrive and start eating your friends and, and you and turning everyone into not zombies clothing. $22. CD discs. $3. Isn't this a lovely day? Uh, well, I, I mean, I guess I'm alive. That's pretty good. Adam Thornton wants to meet you. It's urgent, he said. Mind your tongue. We owe it all to him. You can keep it too. His office is located at the peak of the Nebelhurst factory. It's seen from anywhere in the city. You can't go wrong. The driver will be waiting for you to bring you to the factory. I'll paint a bl uh, blank with the code by the time you get back. Rightio. Hello. <sighs> Roots to the north are cancelled. It's so boring without work. Oh, trust me. You do not want to have to go that way. You are very much better off right now. Was that something I could pick up? No. Some buses. Uh, ooh, a news... $50 for a newspaper? Um, probably not, mate. Prices for newspapers are getting higher every day. Information about the outer world will be a luxury soon. Yes, for $50 for a newspaper. We won't get in trouble. Mark my words. What? He's from the plant. Uh, what? The fellow who's driving? Uh, hmm. Oh, there's black stuff all over the floor there. I'm a little bit concerned about that. Hello? Can I, can I, can I talk with you, sir? No? No, no talking with you? Fair enough. Uh, hello, madam. Jack! Is it for you again? Um... I have no idea. Is that Jack? I would like to speak with Jack. Ah, oh, I can't get to them on that side. Okay. Thanks, Maeve. Phone? Yes, there's a call box in the next street. Very well. Ooh. Medicine. Buy two medkits. Expensive, man. But, uh... What's this, then? Well, that's the first time we've seen that mechanic. Have I missed that on the previous levels? I don't think I have. Hello. You aren't open yet. If you need a room, go upstairs. Uh, alright. I wonder if I can hear you. Spoons, cigarettes, good things, lots of good things. Hello. Oh, hello. Where to go? What for? Hmm. Uh... Maybe I was asking him if he had somewhere else he wanted to go, and I was offering to take him there by the train. Is there anything I can imagine? I met an old man today. It looks like he already lost his marbles. However, he told me something very important about the first visitation. I need to get to that canyon. But the train will head west in just a week. I'll go north in the morning. It'll be faster this way. Ah, so that is X again. Unless it's just a bunch of people signing the name with X, which could be the case. Well, we have two vacant rooms. The first is to the right, but it needs cleaning. Some crazy nut lift there. 
and an adjacent lodging outside, but there's a leak there. You may look around. Uh, as it happens, I've already looked. Can I not get off on that floor? No. I guess that's the leak, though. Yeah, I guess they're collecting all the, the pipe waste. That's a lovely little detail there. Uh, just chilling out, watching the nuclear sunrise slash sunset. That is probably a way back up from somewhere. Another visitor. Do you get many random people just walking into your house? Are you also to my grandpa? He is in, but please, be quick. I don't ask, and don't ask about the settlers. His family suffered a lot at that time. Okay, who on earth is your grandpa then? Someone important? Is that be just because your eye is blind, or have you got one white eye, one red eye? Because that's disconcerting. Yes, I caught up to it. The first visit. I often offered to talk about it, but I noticed that hardly anybody really listens to me. I suppose so many years later, nobody needs the true story. I do. It all started with capsules. They fell from the sky. Aha! I knew it! One of them fell a block away from our house. Gas from these capsules somehow affected people. I knew it! It's good you already know. But there's a detail people often skip. Not everybody felt the same effects from the gas. Sorry. I can't talk long. Ah, so some people had a different reaction to the gas? I mean, I guess. I've been around that gas loads and I haven't gone crazy yet. Maybe I will? Check on this phone. Who was I calling? Who was I calling? Who did I have to call? There we go. Nothing there. Ooh. Wine cellar of some kind? Oh, hello. Um, can you shut the door before we're discovered? I, I I wish I could, sir. Uh, afraid I can't, however. All right, well, that was a bit of an interesting one. So, we've got... Hello, do you say anything? No, you do not. Ammo. Ooh, what are these? Um, oh, extended clip. Laser sight. They're very tempting. Shotgun ammo. Super expensive. Pistol ammo. Reasonably expensive. Hmm. Well, why not? I'm not busy for the rest of the day. Oh, so I've got a... Got a... Someone like a survivor. Ooh, food. I'm going to say we need that. Super bad. So yeah, I'm going to buy two of them. Thanks, but I'm not interested. Annoy someone else. Well, fair enough. Your life, mate. Oh, wow. Those really do look like some sort of crazy robot eyes. Please, get into the car. He awaits you. Very well. I am awaiting. Can I use this? Oh, I just came back. Ha ha ha! Sorry. 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 I, I, I'll, I'll try not to dig around. Good afternoon. Are you here for the meeting? Uh, yes. Let me see. Well... Ah, yes. Mr. Thornton is waiting for you to come... Uh, for you... Come in. I was gonna say, to come in, but... <sighs> Look, I appreciate where I broke off that sentence before correcting myself. Did leave that sentence in a bit of a, a questionable state. But I have explained what my intention was. You cannot hold it against me. And let's have a look. Ooh, hello. The power unit is powering the plant and the whole city. We need to monitor his condition very closely. His condition. If one of the sides overheats, something irreversible might happen. His condition? Can I go there? No, I cannot. Hello then. I know. Don't worry. Electron particles from the mines interfere with radio waves. That's why people don't even know what's going on. 
This fog protects them from the external world. Moreover, they still avoid these places. But that's not your concern. Hmm? Warn them if you want, but they won't believe you anyway. Let's get down to business. Time is running out. According to the contract with the council, in case of the second visit, I have to give up the factory's energy core to charge the Guardian with it. The council should have provided transport, but I think you understand that your train is the only running thing. I gave the order to attach the cargo with the energy core to your train, so it's better you hurry up. I know there's no way to jump over the blockers, but that's your problem. See you soon. Oh, I don't know. Last town I visit kind of blew up. Spectacularly. But still, it blew up. Okay. Um. Really tempted, actually. Yeah, I'll take I'll take that, I think. Um. I wish there was a way for me to know how much mad kids I had, because. I'm gonna sell, sell one because I can craft med kits. And uh, oh, it's 850. Oh, you scallywag, you! I'll sell one one ammo and then I'll buy this. There we go. So I've got the extended clip and I've got the um, laser sight. Whether this will help me in any way, I have no idea, but we'll see. Hello. I don't have enough anymore. <laughs> I would totally have bought that newspaper, though, if I had the money. Okay. Um, oh, there you are. Joshua Bands, head of Bristol Station. Confirmation of blockers code 5635. The cargo is already attached. Have a nice day. Oh, I doubt it. Okay, but before we get aboard the train, we're going to have to wrap this episode up there. I hope you've been enjoying. We've certainly got a little bit more of the story. It seems that we are going to be heading to the Guardian, whatever that might be, with a power core that is referred to as a he. Now, that could just be a turn of phrase that they use for something they're very familiar with, an object. You know, you often um, project human elements and, and features onto things um, but it could also be something very literal I am quite curious to find out what that core is and how the story is going to unfold and I hope you are too but I shall see you in the next episode as ever if you have any feedback then do drop a comment down below and if you want to see more of this game in the future then leave a like on the video but until next time take care everyone <laughs>